Yeah, here in the basement, and we're looking at a uh, high efficiency furnace replacement. You'll see the piping that's actually running and, and exiting around the rim board. It's going to get a measure on what that is. Yeah, it's a looks like it's a three inch, three inch uh, exhaust and uh, intake. We do have a um, isolating valve and drip on the gas. You can see the electrics are all in a sleeve. The drain is run in vinyl and it actually looks like it's running across, across the floor to a drain that's at the back. Line set as I showed outside is really close by so we'll uh, replace that. It's just kind of going between the return drop and out. As far as the return is actually concerned, yeah, we've got um, an opportunity to put the wider um, filter rack in there. So you can see the space at the top here to be able to make the adjustment um, you know, for that wider filter. Yeah, I've got the measurements of the uh, height of the bottom of the joist to the floor. Uh, as far as access is concerned, it is a walkout, um, so we can um, there's an alley we can um, have the equipment at the back and then bring it in um, to the furnace that's located in the front. There are some actual some some uh, ducts that could be tidied up while we're here. I'm just going to show them. You can see this one here that has a hole, kind of where it's um, in the boot. Another one that's kind of got some old tape on it. And then we have some other ones, like two others um, at the back on either side that um, if there's any thoughts on sealing those up, you can kind of see where the, there's a separation. That's it.